guys so I'm back with another story time and this story time is crazy this is the time that I made sure that mm, all right let's start from the beginning I ain't even gonna do an intro so you to stay tuned I'm gonna just get straight into it all right so basically I was with this guy and we was dating for a while and next thing you know things happen and he started talking to somebody else meanwhile we were talking to each other like we were boyfriend and girlfriend like clear as day boyfriend and girlfriend but then he started talking to like this other girl because we had like a little issue you know between our parents and he didn't know how to break up with me so one day I saw him flirting with another girl I'm just like well what's going on next thing you know they talk so I was just like you know what we're done so come to find out him and the girl is now dating like next week right this is crazy this is my boyfriend of six years now like well we don't go out anymore no longer obviously but back then we were only like what one year in so he started talking to her and I was just like what the heck <laughs> and I found out they was going out so what I did was oh that is so funny y'all wouldn't understand okay so what I did was I wasn't sad about it because listen it's whatever things happen there's no ring on this finger so like you want to talk to somebody else cool but you got the wrong one you got the wrong girl so let me tell you guys what I did I knew the girl and she was so sweet so nice and I used to do her hair so one day I went up to her I was like you and so and so talk and she's like yeah we talk mind you she knew that was my boyfriend she knew because my school was like really really small we was it was a small school so everybody knew everybody's business everything so for y'all to be flirting he had to tell you something totally different whatever so I was like y'all yeah, talk she's like yeah after everybody told her not to tell me, I was like, oh, okay, well, that go out? Yeah, I was like, oh, congratulations, congratulations, girl, and everything like that, and I was just like, oh, let me tell you how to make sure that like, you're perfect for him and everything like that, your hair is looking a little, you know, messed up right now, let me fix it, so I did her hair, made sure she was cute, everything, I was like, oh, you know what you should do? take him to this spot do this and that i befriended her like we used to talk but we wasn't close but i made sure she was my bff now because there's no way in hell that he's gonna go and talk to somebody else behind my back you know because our parents don't get along okay so boom he i figured you know we're best friends you didn't like something about me that you had to break you had to you know go talk to somebody else i'm gonna make the girl that you like just like me so i did her hair like me i made sure that i gave her advice that was of me you know what i'm saying so obviously when he's looking at her he'll be remembering me there's no way in how that somebody's gonna walk away from me or I'm gonna let you go and you think you're gonna have a pleasant pleasant life <laughs> okay well I sound pretty crazy right <coughs> all right so boom I don't know what happened but the same thing he did to me he did to her he started talking to somebody else <laughs> It's so sad because everybody was laughing at her. Like, everybody told her, like, don't get involved with him. He was, like, the high school jock. You know, he was on the basketball team, the best player on the basketball team, and everybody liked him. So, he was popular. I was popular in my own way because I was a part of a girl group and stuff like that. And I sang. Like, I could sing. So, I was always singing in front of the school. Everybody knew me, and I was loud, and I was just, I was just always in something so um yeah he started talking to my yells and that's when i came back in i'm just like all right come on you're doing too much or whatever 
and I don't know how we got back together but this is like literally the shortest story time ever because point of story is there's no way of running like we ended up getting back together and we ended up being together for six years and now we're not together at all and it's okay you know that's life um sometimes you go your separate ways you get older obviously I'm not in high school anymore and I finished college so like your mindset is so different it's in a whole nother place so he's doing his own thing I'm doing my own thing we both chilling but that's pretty much my story time the shortest story time without any breaks ever I made sure that my ex-boyfriends well my current ex-boyfriend's ex-girlfriend was just like me he had no choice but to come back to me befriend the girlfriend I'm telling you and don't do no maliciousness like don't be malicious with it like oh give her bad advice I made sure that her hair was looking real nice I made sure you know she carried herself real nice she took him to all his spots I made sure of all that that's the crazy part I didn't do no malicious like give her tell her anything bad about him or anything like that like no I ain't that kind of girl like we not we not better I don't do that thing those kind of things anymore I will say I do go after what I want and no one's gonna take it from me that's the one thing I can let you know when I want something it's mine anyways if you like this video thumbs it up subscribe and comment let me know was I crazy was I wrong like what do you think and I'll see you guys in the next story time bye